So I am embarking on a new journey and this is the polymath challenge. So I just challenged myself to challenge myself and what it actually entails is that I'm going to spend the next 90 days um, challenging myself to be a polymath which is to learn something in 90 days. However, this is going to be um, something that I am learning through like learning and refining something that I'm doing. So it's a path that is just about learning and figuring out how I can develop my skills in um, a few key areas. So poly meaning many. So the polymath challenge to me it's going to be about um, coding. I don't know a lot about coding and here's a disclaimer that the challenge is actually nine, 100 days but I've been doing it for 10 days right now and I am, I am now going for the other 90 days which I'll be documenting here. Um, I first did 10 days so that I could just see what I could do and what I couldn't do because it is a challenge. So it includes coding and uh, basically learning Java HTML, CSS, and VBA. It, it also includes writing. I will be writing, my target is to write 5,000 words, which was proving to be very difficult in the past 10 days. So I will still target 5,000, but I think what's more practical will be around um, 1,000 words, because it's going to be, uh, well, maybe 2,000 words. Well, I'll still keep the number at 5,000, see how many I will average at the end of 90 days. And the challenge is also going to include Chinese, which will be <laughs> something on its own. And then it's going to also include um, daily exercise. So it's about health, wealth, and wisdom. To be healthy, to be wealthy, to be wise. And this is the polymath challenge. And yeah. And this is the path to being the polymath. So I think it's going to be enjoyable, it's going to be challenging, it's going to be tough. But um, at the end of the day, it's going to be amazing.